Vince, welcome to Exeter City. Joining us from Eastleigh, how are you feeling? Yeah, uh, buzzing to finally get it sorted. Um, it's been a few weeks in the making, so it's nice to be here, have a look around and get it all signed. Making the step up from the National League into League One, that must be a really exciting challenge for you. Yeah, yeah. Well, looking forward to embracing it and sort of seeing what League One football is like and showing all the Exeter fans what I can do on the pitch. Tell us a little bit about how this move came about for you. Um, I think uh, I think I had a sort of good season at Eastley, and I think Eastley uh, Exeter come to watch me a few times. So I think it's just accumulated into into a move like this now. Obviously, it's the summer. Players and management are all over the place. But yeah. um, Gary is keen on players who, who sort of buy into his ethos and his identity. And and albeit perhaps over the phone, have you spoken to the manager about that? Yeah, well, I went and met him. Um, and he sold it to me. Um, everything he was saying, I sort of was buying into, and I think it's a, it's a good match for myself as a player and, and the club. And I think things will go well. Someone who knows this area quite well, obviously coming from from Bristol City, and, and you've played for Western Supermare and, yeah. and Bath. So yeah. perhaps it's nice to come to a club that perhaps in an area that, that's not too unfamiliar. Yeah, yeah, obviously local-ish, uh, living in Bristol and, like you said, playing for all them clubs. Um, yeah, it's nice to sort of be back down these ways. Difficult question, this one perhaps, but describe yourself as a player. Describe perhaps your style and, and what you'd like to do on the pitch. Uh, I'd say I'm quite an energetic player. Um, obviously, I'm a full-back, but can play wing-back. Uh, I love, love to defend and tackle, but I love going forward as well and just injecting a bit of energy. Where needed. Playing with those win backs is something I know that the current manager and previous manager at this football club have, have loved to do, and it's such a competitive position. And I imagine you'll be looking forward to, to competing and, and challenging for those positions. Yeah, I think whatever club you go to, I think it's good to have competition for the places because I think competition is good and it sort of drives both of, both the players or whoever's competing for the position to give it their best. And if you give it your best, then more often than not, you do well. You've come down to the club at the right time. We're on an upward trajectory and you know, we've not long moved into this fantastic new training ground facility. I mean, what's your first impressions of the building and sort of your surroundings? Yeah, it's banging to be fair from, from what I've seen. Yeah, it's pro proper good here. Uh, it looks all modern and stuff like that as well. But you've, I can see you've got some stuff that was here before, which is good. But yeah, all, of, all in all, impressed with it all. It's nice, yeah. You've got the luxury as well. We brought you in early. Of, you'll have a full and complete pre-season and, and when the players come back on the 22nd of June, you'll get straight from the off, you'll get to mix it and get to learn about your new teammates and, and build yeah. relationships with them. Yeah, yeah, looking forward to it. Uh, obviously pre-season, new people come and people go, but I sort of know of a few players here, so it'd be nice to sort of get to know them better and sort of see what Exo is all about. What are your goals and, and your ambitions as your time with us? Uh, just to have success, both individually and as a team. Uh, I'd like to grab a few goals and assists. Um, and yeah, just be defensively solid, really. Yeah.